Now I'm going to make a pillow to put on the back and attach my lap truck to. But if you have a pre-made pillow you want to use, that would work just as well. So I have my piece of fabric. I put the wrong side together. So it doesn't really matter on this piece of fabric because both sides are the same. But if you had a print on it, you would want to put the print side in so they're together. Now I'll sew this and then stuff it and I'll come back and show you what it looks like. Okay, now I have my pillow. I sewed it up. I turned this, I turned it right side out. I stuffed it and I sewed it closed. Now I want to put my latch hook on here. So what I'm going to do is see this, see this extra backing that sticks out beyond the edge on here. What I'm going to do is cut it off, all of it off, except for, I think I'll leave two rows on. See, I'll go one, two rows. And this is kind of up to you what you think will work best with your rug and putting it on, but I think I'll leave two rows on. And then I'll show you how to sew it on. Now we got our edges cleaned up a little there. Okay, and now you want to get some thread, some pretty heavy duty thread, okay? And you're going to hand sew this on. So you're going to put it through the needle. Once you have it through the needle, you're going to take it and then meet up the two ends of the thread, line it up, then you're going to want to make a knot. Wrap it around your finger once, twice, three times, and then push it off with your thumb. Once it comes off, pull it tight. You have a knot. And, and it's double thick. Now we have our latch hook on our pillow. And if you use safety pins to pin it onto the pillow, it will stay in place a lot better while you sew it. So you're going to hand sew this on. So you need to get some fr some thread, some pretty heavy duty thread, put it on a needle. I always double mine up, but you don't have to if you don't want to. Then tie a knot at the end, and what you want to do is you come over here, and where you have put your um, strings for your latch hook, you want to go through as close as you can on the center, right there, on the same one the latch hook was done on. So, and just like you were sewing, you go.
And on the first mm -hmm. one, you want to tie up the by going through the center of the loop on the thing. And then you just keep going down and go. line where the last twist was done, you go under and back up and then move on to the next one and under and back up. And you want to do that all the way around and then you'll have your latch hook pillow. I have my piece of fabric and you want